This is Amelie Arena, home of the Tampa Bay Lightning. Back-to-back -back Stanley Cup champions 2020-2021. storm Saturday afternoon everyone online to buy merchandise boat parade in two days continue to celebrate here in Tampa Bay and we're gonna do it the way we do it in Tampa Bay which is the original boat parade so we this is Amelie Arena and it is parade day shirt before it's completely doused in sweat because it should be in the 90s and we're expecting thunderstorms how appropriate so we're starting our day down by the convention center it's just after 9 20 crowds are gathering but lightning strikes twice so we've picked up the new bud light 2021 champions and this is the cores and that's what it's called. And this is the Coors Champions Ice, brewed with water melted from the ice from game one of the championship series. So this big thing is just my water bottle we picked up the other day. But this Coors, brewed with ice from Amelie Arena. Cheers, everyone. Tastes like hockey pucks and stick tea. Honestly, it just tastes like regular Coors Light or Miller Light. Closing in at 10 o'clock, we've got to find a spot because it's starting to pick up here. Indeed. We are a solid one deep. Lots of stationary boats out there. The mandate this year is that boats are not allowed to join in on the parade. There's a police boat. That's like an optimal spot up there. Clear, unobstructed view down below. TV set up. I don't know, is this a good spot? And we've got our spot. So just at 10 o'clock, this place is filling up quick. And this boat is gliding right into another boat. Yes, indeed. Non-stop boats. Boats, boats, boats. Even the police flying the bolts flag. <laughs> That's some number one bullshit. Number one bullshit. Oh, number one bullshit. The boats are settling in as we're getting ready for this to kick off.
It's 11.25, the parade has kicked off. It has not reached here yet. But look at all of these people. We still have boats going through here. The first boat has arrived. And it's White Claw. Not to be outdone, Mike's Hard Lemonade. Guy and his dog on a jet ski just got some freebies. Media going by. We have Thunderbug. That is the mayor of Titletown. Oh, and the bridge opens. Throwing beers from the boats.
Whoa, mega yacht coming in.
it's crashed. Well, there were supposed to be no private boats going up and down the canal here, but there's tons of them. Police are literally not really doing much about it. The raid is seemingly stopped with just a ton of police around. That's all she wrote for the parade. All right, time to keep on moving. This is the scene post parade. Endless amounts of people. Some of the players coming back around again. Somebody jump in the water. Another person. The song of my people. The cops are scooping up the people jumping in the water. More souls of the party. So I left the Tampa area before the celebration because this is what the sky looks like. Well, this brings another season to a close. One that I never thought that I'd be saying. We're back-to-back -back champions, or back-to-boat champions, as they said today. Second Stanley Cup in a row. Mind-blowing. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, last year, I didn't get to go to the parade um, because I had just been recovering from COVID at the time. And when the Lightning won... Um, it was emotional, but watching the parade on TV was very emotional to me because I didn't get to um, go to the parade and celebrate with everybody else. Being in Orlando um, doesn't necessarily make you a fan of Tampa sports. Um, for those that are watching the video from out of state or out of country, um, if anything, people in Orlando are pretty ambivalent about uh, Tampa sports, whether it's the Buccaneers, the Lightning, or the Rays. Uh, for the most part, folks stick with whatever teams they migrated in from. Um, so uh, we've been supporting the Lightning for uh, the last, you know, almost 20 years of living in Florida. So 
um, incredibly joyous, <laughs> I guess for lack of a better term, to um, not only see, you know, this plastic cup, but to see the actual Stanley Cup um, two times, two years in a row, um, in addition to the cup back in 2004 as well. But we've been sharing our love for the Lightning with you guys for a long time, and it's phenomenal when we find other folks um, that have come into the channel because of us talking about sports and even the Orlando Magic or Daytona Tortugas and, and even the New York Mets. Um, we were walking outside of Amelie on Saturday from the store and someone that watches the channel literally was driving by in their car and screamed out the window, hey Jeep Seats. And that type of stuff, um, it, it's better, it's a better feeling than uh, even running into folks at the theme parks for as much theme park content that we've done and horror nights and stuff like that um, it was just amazing but it was amazing to see this today in person to see the parade in person and to celebrate with all of the other tampa fans out there so thanks a lot for coming along thank you very much for all of your likes comments and subscriptions treat others the way you want to be treated now now that covid is over uh we gotta get in to emily for the raising of the banner this time around it's the mission thanks a lot for watching see you guys this is raymond james stadium home of the defending super bowl champion tampa bay buccaneers you're up next boys